Hi guys, welcome to the RPB Resonance Chemistry. Now let's continue our lectures on electrochemistry. Today we are going to deal with uh, one of the applications of EMF value, that is electrode potential value. Okay. Now here the applications of electromotive force value. So here six applications are there. So one is the thermodynamic terms, and uh, second one is the determination of a transport number. So now the third one is the equilibrium constant. Uh, how it is find the equilibrium constant from the general equation. Now the fourth one is the solubility product, which is the very important. These two are very important things uh, which are uh, uh, regularly asked in our competitive exams. Now the fifth one is activity coefficient. Uh, sixth one is calculation of pH. Calculation of pH. These six factors which are discussed in our uh, applications of EMF part. Okay. Now uh, thermodynamic terms which are already discussed in our previous video. So now the transport numbers without knowledge about uh, like with the trans concentration cell with the transference and without transference we cannot predict the these transport numbers. That's why uh, we will postpone these these topic after the like concentration cell with the transference and without transference and the liquid liquid junction potential. Now uh, equilibrium constant. Third one, that is the uh, equilibrium constant. It is very important one regarding to the like uh, JE mains uh, uh, advanced topics, uh, JE mains and advanced as well as CSR net and the gate. So here it is the common question uh, regularly. So uh, twice in a year, definitely they are asking about one question regarding to the uh, equilibrium constant. Now, so today we are going to deal with equilibrium constant and its previous year problems. Now the fifth one, solubility product. So which is uh, uh, regularly one by one, I'll, I'll discuss with the, all those uh, applications of EMF. Okay. Now today we are going to deal with uh, so third application that is equilibrium constant. Okay, now the equilibrium constant. So today we are deal with the equilibrium constant. Okay, so simply it is called as K equilibrium. Okay, now here this is the reaction A A plus B B will give rise to C C plus D D C C plus dd okay now here uh, this is the uh, uh, according to the thermodynamics term d delta g is equal to delta g naught like a plus uh, rt ln q this is the reaction coefficient q is equal to reaction coefficient that is uh, concentration of uh, like a product by concentration of a reactant concentration of a product by concentration of a reactant okay so this is the reaction coefficient okay now we know that uh, the work uh, energy which is uh, uh, which is obtainable from the cell that is nothing but delta g is equal to minus n of e cell okay so if it is a standard value then we will get the minus n of e naught cell minus n of e naught cell so let us substitute these two values over the our uh, first equation now we will get the like n of e cell minus n of e cell minus n of e naught cell okay so plus uh, rt ln q rt ln q now here uh, in these two equations nf is there that's why the total equation which is divided by the nf so that is divided by the minus nf so so minus nf minus nf cancel minus nf minus nf cancel now here e cell is equal to e naught cell minus here uh, plus into minus minus rt by nf so it is left out rt by nf so this is the ln q so it seems to be like a nnst equation calculation it's not seems to be it is the, it is the nnst equation calculation okay now here it is the e is, cell is equal to e naught cell e cell is equal to e naught cell minus rt by simply uh, those ln values can convert into log so 2.303 rt by like a n alpha into log of q Okay, this is the simply our knowing Nernest equation, Nernest equation formula. Okay, so with the help of Nernest equation formula, at the time of equilibrium, that means uh, here the like left hand, the left hand compartment. So one of the compartment cell and the right hand compartment, both are equilibrium to each other, the flowing of electrons and flowing of the current. So both are at the same time equilibrium to each other at the time. So K reaction coefficient is equal to the K. Reaction coefficient is equal to the K. Here it is the reaction coefficient reaction quotient now here k is equal to equilibrium constant equilibrium constant okay now here when q is equal to k so then e cell so e cell value there is no potential difference if both are both are left left side equal left side and right side compartment both having the same electrode potential there is no negative there is no differentiation so if the potential difference is absorbed from the one cell to another cell then we absorb the emf value so without any differentiation that equilibrium position e cell is equal to zero now, at equilibrium at equilibrium e cell is equal to the zero Okay, now let us substitute these two values over the above equation. So now here it is E cell is equal to 0. Now E standard cell 
So now minus 2.303 into R into T by NF. Okay. Now here log at reaction coefficient. At equilibrium, reaction coefficient is nothing but K equilibrium. So now here it is the K equilibrium value. Here it is the K equilibrium value. So at 25 degree centigrade temperature, that means 298 kelvins. 25 degree centigrade temperature, that is nothing but 298 kelvins. So 2.303 into R into T by F. So 2.303 R T by F is equal to the 0 0.0591, 0 0.0591. Sometimes they are asking the questions like 2.303 R T by F is equal to 0 0.05953, 0 0.59534. So here at 20, 25 degree centigrade temperature, here at 27 degree centigrade temperature, these two are the values, okay? 0 0.0591 is 25 degree centigrade temperature, 0 0.0595 is 20, uh, 27 degree centigrade temperature, that is equal to the 300 kelvins, okay? Based on these values, so let us substitute these values over there. Now here, E cell is equal to 0, so that means uh, here 0 is equal to E naught cell minus 0 0.0591 upon N. So here, Faraday is uh, also calculated in another value, so N over N left over, so then log k equilibrium is observed. Log k equilibrium is observed. Now here, E naught cell is equal to E naught cell is equal to 0 0.0591 upon n into log k equilibrium. Log k equilibrium. So now here, log k equilibrium is equal to. Okay. So now n is denominator. It will shift it to the right left side. Then it is big one. It could uh, it, it becomes a numerator. It came to the numerator. N e naught cell by 0 0.0591. Okay, so in, ca in case of a mathematical calculations, so log x is equal to y, then x is equal to 10 to the power by. Okay, so if log x is equal to y, then x value is equal to 10 to the power by. So in case of ln x is equal to y, so if x is equal to e power y, why? Because here ln having the base e, log having the base 10, that's why base 10 power e y. So that's why e power y, base e power y. So based on that here, log k equilibrium is equal to something, then k equilibrium is equal to 10 to the power n e naught cell by 0 0.0591 so this equation is applicable at 25 degree centigrade temperature so in case of different temperatures let us substitute those values and uh, and calculate the your, uh, your values your k equilibrium values so this is the simplest equilibrium formulae which are helpful for predicting the e cell values which are helpful for predicting the e cell k equilibrium values so this is the formula okay now i'll write the equilibrium value k equilibrium is equal to 10 to the power n e naught cell upon 0 0.0591 10 to the power n e cell upon 10, 0 0.0 Finally. This is the very important equation. Now let's go through the some of the problems. Okay, guys. Now let's solve the some of the problems regarding to the uh, 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 K equilibrium constant. Okay? This is the question December 2018. This is the 2016 December, 2013 December, 2012 December. All are four mark questions. Now here it is gate 2012 question. Okay, now let us solve the fifth question. That is the gate 2000. Uh, get 2012 so now for the following reaction 2mno4 minus 5h2c2o4 plus 6h plus will use the 2mn plus 2 plus 8h2o plus 10co2 so this is the simplest reaction 2 moles of kmno4 will uh, will treat it with 5 moles of h2 like a c2o4 that is a formic acid so here 3 moles of h2so4 which becomes a 2mn so4 plus 8 waters plus 10 CO2, 8 waters plus 10 CO2. So in a single reaction, KMnO4, that means MnO4 minus, so which, which becomes Mn plus 2, that means here the five, five number of electrons are transferred. Single KMnO4 can convert into Mn plus 2, that means Mn plus 7, 2 plus 2. So here the gaining of five electrons at the same time, gaining of five electrons, that means one Mn can convert into a plus 2, here it requires five electrons. Two KMnO4 requires two into five electrons, that is 10 electrons are required here n is equal to 10 electrons okay now we know that uh, if we know the value of young again the emf values are there so e cell values that is 1.51 volts again another one is 0 0.49 so here it is the mn plus 7 2 plus 2 that is the reduction value that's why they are given in the reduction potential again uh, here it undergoes the reduction so both are same so now here it undergoes the oxidation that sign will be changed so now minus becomes plus so now uh, 0 0.49 plus 1.51 that is equal to the 2.00 so here it is the emf value e naught cell value okay now the equilibrium constant is equal to 10 to the power n e naught cell by 0 0.0591 so now here 2 into 10 to the power so n is equal to 10 10 into e cell value is 2 by 0 0.06 approximately it is equal to the 0 0.06 so 10 to the power 
20 by 0.06 है यार द अप्रॉक्सिमेट वैल्यू इज इक्वल टू 10 टू द पावर 338 okay now we don't know so let us let us go through that so 20 by 0 0.06 that is equal to the 2000 by 6 2000 by 6 now the value is 3 times 18 so 2 is left over 20 again 3 times 20 is left over again 3 times approximately 333 point something 333.33 our option which is closer to the 338 that's why so the value is 338 then option is b so b is correct now this is the uh, another question now the first question which is in our uh, like uh, our topic now let us go through the another problem <laughs> okay now the second uh, the first problem that is uh, the equilibrium constant for the following reaction which is given in december 2018 question 2018 question okay now the esl value one is 0 0.15 another one is 0 0.15 so here one is the negative value another one is the positive value so now here sn can undergo the sn plus 2 Again, Sn plus 4 can convert into Sn plus 2. So here it is the it undergoes the oxidation, here it undergoes the reduction. So wherever oxidation takes place, that sign will be changed. Sn, Sn plus 2, so here it undergoes the oxidation, but they are given the reduction potential. So the sign of negative value is changed, then the value is equal to 0 0.30. So this is the E0 cell value. Okay, now we know the K equilibrium value. Uh, 10 to the power N E0 cell upon 0 0.0591. So now here 10 to the power number of electrons uh, Sn can convert into Sn plus 2 here also 2 electrons so plus 4 to plus 2 it is also 2 electrons that's why N is equal to 2 electrons into E0 cell value 0 0.3 by 0 0.06 approximate value 0 0.06 here 0 0.6 by 10 to the power 0 0.6 by 0 0.06 that is equal to the 10 to the power 6 by like 0 0.6 so simply it is equal to the 60 by 6 that is equal to the 10 to the power 10 okay so a particular value they are giving the like 10 to the power 10 power 0 0.8 so the option number c is option c is correct option c is correct now let us solve another problem that is uh, December 2016 problem very easy pretty easy questions now here they are giving the Zn plus 4 NH3 here uh, it forms the Zn NH3 4 times uh, plus 2 complex so they are given in the cell value E0 cell is equal to 1.03 so another value another Zn can convert into their cations here the cell value is 0 0.763 0 0.763 now here uh, Zn which undergoes the reduction, they are given the reduction potential, but Zn can convert into Zn plus 2, zinc can convert into zinc plus 2, that is oxidation reaction, so that's why we change the sign of the bottom one. So now we, are, we will get the 2.67, E cell, E naught cell value is equal to 0 0.267. Now we know that the equilibrium constant value, K equilibrium is equal to 10 to the power N E naught cell upon 0 0.0591 okay now we know the n number of electrons here two electrons are there that's why here the electrons are two two into e cell value 0 0.267 approximately it is equal to the 0 0.27 by 0 0.06 now 0 0.27 that means 0 0.54 by 0 0.06 here 10 to the power 0 0.06 now again so here it is equal to the 10 to the power 54 by 6 so in, in 200 by 100 that means here so two point decimal will shift it to the right side so to here two places shifted bottom also two places shifted now here six ones are six nines are 10 to the power nine is our option 10 to the power nine is our option so option number c is correct here it is option number c is correct now let's go through the third problem so already three problems are over but the number serial number is third okay now the consider the cell of zn zn plus 2 so here they are given in the like different different concentration values so again they are given in the value zn2 fe plus 3 which is equal equilibrium to each other now zn plus 2 plus 2 moles of iron plus 2 is there okay now in case of log k values that is the k equilibrium value from the nnst equation so here they did they didn't given the like a particular e naught cell value they are given in the e cell okay so i think here uh, sorry so here they didn't given the e naught cell so we are finding the e naught cell so they are given the only e cell value now i did a mistake that's why i'll write over there so now here uh, without without giving the without uh, any information regarding to the e naught cell so we will calculate the e naught cell value from the nnst equation e is equal to e naught cell minus 0 0.0591 upon n into log of concentration of a product by concentration of a reactant simply concentration of a product that is equal to zn plus 2 into like iron plus 2 whole square now here the reactant concentration iron plus 3 whole square into zn okay now here e naught value we don't know but e value they are given 1.71 volts okay now e naught is equal to 0 0.0591 upon n into n that means here two electrons are transferred 
okay so here zn can converts into zn plus 2 so here two moles of iron plus 3 can gain, gain converts into iron plus 2 whatever the cases whichever the cases two electrons only transferred that's why n is equal to 2 so now log of uh, zn plus 2 concentration now here zn plus 2 so that can zn plus 2 concentration is uh, like uh, here 10 to the power minus 3 okay so they are given in the like iron plus two. so let us come uh, consider the zn plus 2 concentration that is equal to the 10 to the power minus 2 okay into iron plus 2 concentration 10 to the power minus 3 whole power 2 that's why because here two number of moles are there so again so iron plus 3 is there so iron plus 3 is 10 to the power minus 2 whole square zinc value it's pure value pure solids concentrations are zero okay sorry it is equal to the unity not zero okay now here 1.71 e naught cell minus 0 0.0591 upon 2 into here 10 to the power minus 2 10 to the power minus 6 by 10 to the power minus 4 so here almost all 10 to the power 10 to the a 10 to the power a into 10 to the power b that is equal to 10 to the power a plus b now here minus 2 minus 6 that is equal to the minus 8 here the minus uh, minus 4 uh, denominator minus 4 will shift it to the numerator then it becomes plus 4 so minus 8 and plus 4 that is equal to the uh, minus 4 okay e naught cell is equal to 0 0.0591 upon 2 into log of sorry i did a mistake 10 to the power minus 4 okay so now log a power m is equal to m log a so uh, that's why so e naught cell value is equal to minus 0 0.0591 upon 2 into minus 4 into log 10 so log 10 value is equal to 1 that's why here there is no value okay so 2 1s are 2 2 are minus into minus plus so e naught cell value is equal to plus 0 0.0591 upon into 1.71 1.71 now i'll uh, love the, these two questions Okay, now let us calculate the, those values. So E naught cell value is equal to uh, like a 1.71 minus 0 0.0591. So here approximately equal to the 1.65 something. 1.65 something. We know that K equilibrium value 10 to the power N E naught cell upon 0 0.0591. So here N is equal to 2, 2 into 1.65. So that is equal to the approximately that is equal to the 3.30, 3.30 by 0 0.0591. Okay, now here approximately 3.30 by 0 0.06. So here it is closer to the 10 to the power 330 by 6. Okay, now 330 by 6 value is equal to 6 phi's. Okay, 33 is left over again 6 phi's approximately 55. Okay, now the closer value is 54. So the option number B is correct. 10 to the power 54 is our value. Okay, now here 10 to the power 27 is there, 54 is there, 81 is there, 40 is there. But our closer value, our answer which is closer to the, so that is a, a 10 to the power 54, that's why option number B is correct. So such type of questions, they are given in the E cell. So those time we required the two times of uh, equilibrium uh, formulas. So the first one with the help of Nernest equation, we will find the E naught value. So after the E naught cell calculation, then only we will calculate the equilibrium value. So uh, don't, don't forget to, to calculate the E naught value. If they are given in the E cell, now we will calculate the E naught value from the Nernest equation. Now the final question is a very easier question. So these are the very easier question which are uh, regularly asked in like a uh, JE mains and advanced also. Okay, don't forget uh, JE mains students. Now, the, the final question is uh, the equilibrium constant of an electrochemical reaction 2FE plus 3, 2FE plus 3 plus SN plus 2, which is uh, like uh, equilibrium to each other, 2 iron plus 2 plus SN plus 4, plus SN plus 4. Here they are given in the like 0 0.75 one value, one is 0 0.15, another one is 0 0.75. So now here SN plus 4 to SN plus 2 iron plus 3 to iron plus 2 both are srp values reduction potential values are given but wherever the oxidation takes place those sign will be changed now here iron plus 3 to plus 2 if this is the reduction sn plus 2 to sn plus 4 that is the oxidation reaction plus 2 to plus 4 so now the sn plus values yes tin values sign will be changed so now tin value sign will be changed this is the e naught cell value so e naught cell value is equal to 0 0.60 0 0.60 now the tan k equilibrium is equal to 10 to the power n e naught cell upon 0 0.059 like 10 to the power 2 into 0 0.6 upon 0 0.06 0 0.6 upon 0 0.6 so here 1 times here 10 times so 10 to the power 20 so 10 to the power 20 i think is there okay so very easy pretty easy problems those type of problems are given in our previous year csr and gate questions okay i think this is very helpful for each and every competitive exams in chemistry okay particularly chemistry topic i think it is helpful for you thank you so much for watching